Hello, and welcome to Rob's Hall of Fame. We have another very, very special episode today. <laughs> Kate is just frozen staring at me. Okay. Today, as you can see, we have the wonderful Janie Stoller. Hello. And we have the incredible Katie Maravich. And today, uh, I will be digging back into my own vault and uh, telling them about somebody who is in my Hall of Fame, and then we will discuss that. First off, Janie. Yes. Have you ever been involved with sports in any way? I have. Really? I, yes. I was How's this? a high school athlete. Was I ran track and cross country. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I never, I've never talked to Janie about... I don't talk about, about sports a lot. Yeah. I think it's okay. like you can tell from my physique, but you can't tell from my personality that I'm big in sports. <laughs> I ran track and cross country, and I, we can touch on this when we talk about the article, but I did win an award for running cross country called the Courage Award because I had the courage... To run. Uh, um, I was last in every race. I was humiliated constantly, and I was brave as hell. <laughs> so, yes, I am a very illustrious athlete. So excellent. Okay. And Katie. Hello. Hello. Um, same question. Yes, yeah, same question. All right. I actually did. I did um, club swimming uh -huh. for a long time, and I danced for a super long time. See, I danced too. Is that a sport? It's, it's no. athletic for sure. It was athletic, but it wasn't a sport. I guess I didn't do sports sports, right. but I did athletic events. <laughs> <laughs> athletic events. <laughs> Tremendous. <Yes. laughs> okay, before we get into uh, this Hall of Fame person today, I just have one honorable mention from the Discord. Uh, uh, somebody nominated a guy named Poop Johnson from, he's a football player, he's in the Canadian Football League. Uh, Poop is not his birth name. Hmm. Uh, his birth name is Corey, but he got the, <laughs> <Duh>. <laughs> but he got the, he got the nickname Poop only a couple years ago. Because uh, he, apparently he had a problem, his weight was fluctuating, like he couldn't keep yes. weight on. Not couldn't keep it on, like he's still a big dude, but like to be yeah. a defensive tackle, you're supposed to be Huge. like close to like 300 pounds or something yeah. like that. So he kept dipping under to like 280 or whatever. Like one, his his weight would fluctuate. So then they asked him about it, and he was like, "Well, uh, I try to poop like five times a day, three times a day. So it's hard to keep the weight on when you got so much going out." Can you control that? I guess you can. I mean, there's things you can take, right? But. Uh, five times a day is a lot. That's a lot. That might be like an intestinal thing. Yeah, I think there's something with poop going on there, maybe. He might have Crohn's. <laughs> oh, is that what happens? That's just an opinion of mine. <laughs> 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 that's not factual. Allegedly. That came from nowhere but my brain. Uh, but he says that he likes the nickname. He says it motivates him. He says... <laughs> <laughs> to poop. <laughs> he says if he plays bad, then they're gonna call him poop for real. Uh, good for him. That that that's an honorable mention. He did not make. I it love anything. that. I love when people take back terms and make it their own. Yes. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, he owns it. He owns. He owns. <laughs> <laughs> Janie has a sketch that's called. Uh, she owns she, it. She owns it. Just own it. <laughs> yeah. And then you're good. You're All good. you got to do is just own up to it. Okay, uh, today, our Hall of Fame person, our Hall of Fame athlete is Elizabeth Sweeney. Some people might remember that uh, last year's Olympics, uh, she competed in, or Winter Olympics, she competed in the, the women's half pipe. Skiing. Yeah, skiing half pipe. Uh, this woman did very very poorly, ended in last place, and upset a lot of people because they felt like she was not of the uh, Olympic caliber, that she did not deserve to be there. What did you, now if you see, we can't show the, the footage of her actual run, uh, which, I mean, she did not advance, she was very quickly eliminated, but she did zero on the half pipe, you're supposed to do, it's like, uh, kind of like with uh, with uh, skateboarding. Like, you're supposed or, to yeah. do, like, tricks and or stuff. Or like what Sean White does. It's Little like, like Yeah, or snowboarding. Yeah, right. Yeah. Yeah, you're, you're supposed, supposed to be doing, like, flips. So she just yeah. goes up and yeah, down. And, down. <laughs> and up and down, which 
most people could not even remotely do. Yes, right. That like, is that's true. true. I was impressed. She's that's not a true. bad skier. She just wasn't an Olympian. Because it's interesting. She found these loopholes to get into the Olympics. Like right. she just so happened to make it in because she's American, but her grandparents were Hungarian, and right. Hungary didn't have the most competitive pool of, you know, half pipe skiers. So like she was in the running, and then there were injuries, and then she happened to qualify. So yeah. It's well, like she still qualified. She still yeah. made it in. She did. Yeah, she did. That's my thing. She did qualify. But she, she took advantage. She like <clears throat> super gamed the system, which right. to me is like, yeah, she deserved to be in. If she, she got in using all the rules, it wasn't like she. Like, she didn't break cheated. any. Rules. As, yeah. as long as her grandparents actually were <clears throat> from Hungary. Yeah. She competed in they this were. in this event. Uh, in 2018, she competed for Hungary. And the, the way that she did it was that, we touched on this, was that uh, for that event, every country only gets four people that they can send. So in the U.S., if there's 20 people, only the top four are going to make it. So And there's uh, 24 spots. Yeah, and there's 24 total spots. So uh, Hungary did not have the... She said that she was the first uh, Hungarian to compete in this specific event. So Hungary obviously didn't have that many people going uh, in this, competing in this event. So they were able to send her as long as she basically, you still have to go through like qualifications and stuff like that, but she basically just had to not fall oh, over. Yeah, yeah. She, that's how she got in. Other people would fall, which is like subtracting more points. Right. And she just was man, like managed to not fall. And then she actually could do an alley oop, they said. Yeah. Which is cool. She didn't want to risk it. But she did. She did it like a little oh, one. she did it in um, the Olympics? During, yeah, and the video we watched. Like a barely, yeah, yeah. yeah she, she did, did like, like a, a tiny super, little one. Yeah. <laughs> it was kind of like watching someone learn to Learn to do yes. the trick. To do it. Well, I also read in that article that you shared that she had tried to get in for skeleton and didn't make that one. Yes. So this yeah. was like, you know what? I'm going to try something new. So I respect it. And she also tried to to play for Venezuela. Oh, I didn't see that. And her her mom was born there, so right. she, But it didn't work out. Like this person just wanted to go to the Olympics so badly. Yeah. That she worked so hard, even though she wasn't the best Olympian. Like she got there. Fairly. I don't understand why right. people are so upset, I guess. She do, well, I get it, because your first emotional response, you have so mm -hmm. many people. She is a, American. Right. Uh, and the fact that she... Cause, but, I mean, I'm with you guys, because there are a lot of people who have American citizenship who mm -hmm. go back to... Play, to uh, uh, I was going to say play for because I'm thinking specifically of basketball, like yeah. Tony Parker. Like there's a lot of like uh, basketball players, Tony Kukoc, where they would go back mm -hmm. to France or wherever they're from uh, to play for that team because the U.S. has such a strong team that they want right. to play for. It. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, this is like a pretty common thing with the Olympics. It is a common thing. But those guys are really good. Right, yeah, <laughs> and, right. she, That's and, the, true. and this whole thing is that she was very uh uh, again, she would be way better than me, right. but I'm saying of the caliber of people who she's competing against didn't seem like on its face that yes. she should have been there, that she had any the business other being Olympians, there on that stage. I, I, I was trying to read more about their feelings, and a lot of them were just like, it was fine. She got here. She did did a yeah, lot of work. Yeah, she didn't beat me. Right. Yeah, she didn't beat so, me. But also, she she like went to um, like so many um, like world events right. to like qualify for the Olympics. Like she was working her ass off to get there. There and like none of the actual athletes seemed offended by it at all. So. Yeah. Well, here's the thing. Like if people think it's a mockery of the Olympics, I think she just puts into greater perspective how great the other ones are. Yeah. Like, sure. Maybe yeah. we need worse Olympians to sort of show you this bar because when you watch a sport Sprint, or you watch some event where you're like, I can't conceptualize mm -hmm. what an average person would be doing. They all look the same. You're yes. like, well, well, okay, what am I comparing it to? Right. Uh -huh. Send in someone who's either horrible or okay, right. and yeah. then they look better. I'd be like, thank you. You show how hard yeah. I work. <laughs> yeah. We're gonna get Janie a. <laughs> we're gonna get Janie an assistant who just does everything very poorly beside her. <laughs> You just wrote a good sketch. <laughs> you just wrote a good sketch. That's really good. That is very funny. Set the bar low. Like she's sleeping. Yes. And 
very come. minimum. Listen, to I can't exceed. let her go. <laughs> You're swinging that bell. She's curve my really. uncle's kid. My cousin. <laughs> my uncle's kid. <laughs> my cousin. I guess. I can't let her go. <laughs> but also, um, she. This woman ran for governor at 19. Yes. Yeah. I was like, against. Arnold, Arnold Schwarzenegger. Schwarzenegger. <laughs> In some ways, it's like she's and she's. What is it about her? I'm curious about like that psychology. Well, is. that's but see, that's another thing that I kind I kind of get the thing of why people are upset because mm-hmm. the more that you find out things about the, like she first tried to compete for Venezuela that didn't work out, and by the way, she competed as you said in the skeleton and didn't make it. Right. What the fuck? <laughs> That's <laughs> like, the easiest. I famously, sport. yes. Yeah. Famously, famously anyone, I can do that. Famously, famously anyone. Yeah. <laughs> famously <It's> anyone. Easy. <laughs> we should. For, have you already formed a skeleton team? Do or you want to do it? I, I have not yet. No. Do you want the three of us to We're form a team? We're available. Do we need, how much is it for a team? Let's just assume it's, it's three, three of us. <laughs> okay, Maybe okay. someone from the Discord can be our. <laughs> yeah. Our We'll just yeah, we'll grab Olympics. somebody. Let's just go. We'll, we'll figure it out. We'll figure Olympics. it out there. I think so. We'll kind of like just wing it. Yeah, yeah. it's fine. Uh, y- yeah, but yeah, at 19, ran against Arnold Schwarzenegger for a very short period of time. But that, yeah, like I was saying, that I get why people are looking at it like, oh, this is just yes. a swindler. She just, that this is, is what she does. That is weird to me that she Th- has a, a history of doing yeah. this. Because wouldn't it be different if she was like, I'm doing this to raise awareness of blank of right yes it just feels very self-serving it is extremely self-serving what she does in interviews because i listened to a couple of her interviews the way Mm -hmm. that she tries to make it seem not so self-serving is that she says that uh i was uh uh, researching or trying to, to connect with my heritage so like her mom (laughs) So like her, her grandparents mo- were there. Just talk to them. <laughs> right. Yeah, Don't go to the Olympics. History? Do they have a skeleton? That just yeah. exactly, <laughs> exactly. Where does the skeleton, does the skeleton, come, skeleton into play? come in? <laughs> you didn't come from like an athletic family. No. They just li- <laughs> they just lived in this place. And I think there are other ways to be able to do that. If she. If this were like a comedian, I'd mm. be fully on board, being like, "This oh, is oh yeah, like a Nathan for you type yeah, thing." Yeah, like this is yeah. such a funny prank. But the yeah. fact that she's not a comedian makes is is a little weird. Mm-hmm. It, yeah, I mean, right? it's, yeah, it's crazy weird. And also, honestly, in her, I know that all this is document and like. Uh, the NPRs reported on like yes, her her grandparents were mm-hmm. Hungarian, Venezuela is where her where her mother is from. Mm-hmm. But when you hear her in interviews, it really sounds like she's lying. It very <gasps> much sounds like she's not really? telling. Really? Yeah, because uh, one interview that I that I saw, she, they kept asking her. <laughs> They were like, okay, yeah, so you competed in in Hungary. So how, and you're American, so what is your connection to Hungary? Mm -hmm. And she's like, oh, uh, that's on my mother's side. And they're like, okay. And then so in 2013, you competed for Venezuela. And then she's like, yeah, that's also on my mother's side. And then they were like, okay, so is it that you're her her mother was Hungarian or but she keeps repeating the same mm. phrase she just keeps my, saying that's yeah. on my mother's that, side yeah that's on my mother it's on my mother's side so either it's, it's, it's entirely because I mean the I, I trust NPR's reporting that they yeah. did they went and researched it yeah but I think that she did not know <laughs> so the she fact that the she said being like oh like, good yeah. awesome <laughs> thank god <laughs> thank Woo, you NPR that is a relief <laughs> Thank you, Terry fe- Gross, yet again. <laughs> <laughs> Terry Gross saves us all. <laughs> they, but, uh, uh, yeah, I think that she was not uh, sure about with how the mm-hmm. connection was made. And uh, it, it just it just it comes off like you're you're scamming. And the, the yeah. fact that she says, oh, I was doing this because of my hit to learn more about my heritage. But. It sounds she like you have no idea hilarious. shit about it. <laughs> There's another category too that I find that I find lovable, which is our country does not have this team, does not have this sport. I'm going to just do it to do it because I want our country represented. Like there was this guy from Tonga who was skiing or like yeah. the classic cool running story. Jamaican bobsled Jamaican team. Bobsled that's exactly team. what I was going to say. It's like that's <laughs> different cuz it's like we just it would be great if we could start representing our country there. Right. This yeah. feels like an American who is like, I want to be in. It's yeah. for me. Absolutely. I don't know why she didn't just say Absolutely. that. Just, just use that thing. Just of like, own it. Just own it. <laughs> <laughs> 
Um, <laughs> yeah, she's, I don't know, what an interesting person. And she'd only been skiing for like eight years. Yes. But she was like genuinely trying, it sounds like. Right. She said that with, yeah. a- after this run that people were calling so terrible, she goes, uh, yeah, I just didn't do my best today. <laughs> <laughs> Normally, I do a lot better. Yeah, a lot better. You guys should see me yeah. in practice. I was yesterday. I was incredible. <laughs> wow, I'm so I good. Know what happened. It's weird that at the Olympics I wasn't great. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. There are so, so many sports too, where like they keep inventing them too. They're, like, yes. Yeah, like hasn't been around that long. Right. I yeah. I think you could start yeah. with if you had a child today, you could definitely get them in the. Olympics, no doubt. If you were like gaming, yes, them absolutely from the start. Yeah, is that really worth My, it? If you feel like if it's not a real, see, that's another thing. How was this? <laughs> sorry, <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. I'm so, uh, so sorry. So aggressive. <laughs> <laughs> is that I couldn't figure out how is it worth it How's for it her? Worth it to be to be traveling the world and doing all these qualification events yeah. and just getting but and you know that people are ridiculing you. Yeah. yeah people so hate what her. is in it for her i don't like, understand i also wonder that about athletes who get found out cheating or doing steroids too it's like yes you got the thing you were lauded mm-hmm. but when that stuff's found out it's so humiliating and yeah. you lose all credibility and you lose all credibility like isn't the honest isn't in its purest form like athletic achievement about truly proving you can do something incredible and you're like making people proud. Right. Somebody like tries to get just, I want Olympian, I want a medal, like those things. I'm like, why do you care so much? What yeah. is it about you? Yeah. If you could have done steroids for cross country. I also ran cross country, oh, by did? the way. Yeah, I did. Wow. But I have I have flat feet. Oh, it was that not, sucks. It was not good. Were you fast though? I was not fast. <laughs> well, I was fast, but my team was really, really good. Oh, really? So yeah, we yes. yeah we won. I was on the right team. Let's yeah. just say that okay. we Cross won country, a lot. It's a team sport. That's the best so we, sport because yeah. it's not like soccer where someone you can screw up the ball and then it's over. It's like yeah. if you just run a little slower, but there's great people on your team. They yeah. don't care what you're doing. Yeah. yeah, you're just running behind them. Yeah, I cannot. I should have did like a, a more like a speed event as opposed yeah. to like a long distance thing. That's hard on flat. Feet. Good God! Yeah, and I didn't realize that I was that I wasn't supposed to be feeling that much pain. Oh no! Really? <laughs> no, I didn't realize oh, it no. until um, uh, until we went to the doctor. Can I and they bring told up me. another point? Well, I was talking, but go ahead. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I just want to stick to the topic. <laughs> yes, I know yes. I'm totally kidding. Katie um, is very much. But she, um, a, another thing that makes this person. A little bit of a of a shithead Uh-oh. is um, oh, oh, sorry for swearing. Swear job. Oh, I, I got it in the five dollars. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. Um, she like made the money through like crowdfunding. No like, way. Yeah. So because it's obviously very expensive to travel yeah. the world. Yeah. And to compete if you don't have things. a sponsor, if you're not famous. And so like, how did she get the money? I just had a short film try to get money, and we couldn't do it. How? How did this, how did she manage? What was her well, tactic? I just to, want to know. She went to UC Berkeley. Did you go to UC Berkeley? That's a great point. <laughs> On the record, Damn, I did not. No. Oh, so, so that, that answers was, it. That was it. That's what happened. But don't you, you don't feel like, I mean, uh, I don't know what her background was. She went to Harvard. Don't you think she, she did go to Harvard? Yes. It's possible the crowdfunding was one rich person. Yeah, that's it's what not I'm. Necessary. That's what I'm thinking. Maybe, yeah, spell. you know, like yeah. Her her grandparents. You have like one. Her Hungarian. Her Hungarian yeah. grandparents. Her very Hungarian grandparents. Yeah. I don't know. Who have never talked to her about Hungary? <laughs> I see, like she was yeah. in. I was in a video I was watching. She did have a corporate sponsor on her arm in a certain uniform, and I was like, "How does that happen? I don't know how yeah. all that stuff works." Yeah, that they just doesn't blanket make sense. like. We're just buying sponsorship for the Hungarian, you know, half pipe, whoever. We don't right. look at the person because it's like, it's kind of losing credit for that brand if <laughs> Absolutely. they're yeah. sponsoring it, you know? I don't yeah. get any of that stuff. I, don't I think, think that would look bad at... for the brand. I would think so. Yeah. I don't think they saw any footage of her competing. <laughs> Either that or they didn't know anything about the half pipe. Right. Uh, yeah. I'm sure. <laughs> yeah. I didn't yeah. even, I didn't even notice that, which, what, uh, what her sponsorship situation was. I'm gonna look into but, it. I'm really curious. Yeah. I would love to be sponsored. 
Oh yeah, for That's comedy. Fun. Yeah, for comedy, like Nike. <laughs> 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 we wear all this Nike stuff. That's yeah, they would idea. get behind your jokes. Yeah, for sure. They? Yeah, why right. not? You're everything. I mean, you're. Did you say I'm everything? You're everything. I was about Katie. to say <laughs> what? I was about to say Thank you're you. everything <laughs> that they represent. I but was going to say. But you said. That well, look, you're at, look at who they look at who they represent. They got Serena Williams. Yes. They got LeBron James. I'm right up there. <laughs> they got Michael Jordan. That's me. <laughs> Drake. <laughs> it's just like me. To, uh, yeah, Katie Maravich. Katie Maravich. That makes sense. But in terms of, like, if Nike is to sports, we would get a pen company and a paper company. Yes. Oh, yeah, that's you know? true. Big. Or a laptop, <laughs> laptop, or a laptop company. company. I'll hey. take it. I don't know what company this is. Who made that? <laughs> Clearly. Who made that? <laughs> but it's I'm just, just generic. Saying. You're right. It's yes. a brandless computer. It doesn't have any brand on it. I love that how we get unbranded computers. <laughs> that, yeah. Can you move those post-its? That is. <laughs> That's weird. They're just yeah. blank. Yeah. Can you just move those? I just want to see. This is so silly. Why do we do this? <laughs> Like no it is one's very gonna. Silly, no. <laughs> Everyone knows. It's so funny. Uh, yeah. Or College Humor could start its own brand and start sponsoring these horrible athletes. <laughs> <laughs> like, yes. Quit your job and do comedy. College Humor. That sounds fun. <laughs> That's absolutely what. Yeah, we should have got should on that. that. We should all do chip in and just sponsor an athlete. Yeah. Sponsor me in the skeleton. Oh no, all us. of us. Right. We're, We're the team. team. And the unnamed Discord person. <laughs> <laughs> what country would we play for? Or not play oh, yeah, for? Oh, yeah, do we have America? Do you have like a way to. Wait, don't you? You don't. Oh, okay. Because you're always talking anything. about the Romanovs or whatever. Oh, yes. I'm the I'm the heir to the Romanov throne. That's, that's <laughs> okay, accurate. So how did that we that... show about you? Yes, that's right. I'm um, Anastasia's great, great. <laughs> Great niece. Okay, so there so, we go. So, yeah, Russia. We'll play for Russia. <laughs> yeah, that'll be Russia. easy. Winter yeah. Olympics. Easy squeeze. <laughs> the skeleton is like everyone's stacked on top of each other, but there's no apparatus. You're like kind of like on like a sled. <gasps> You're on a sled. sled. You, no one's stacked. No one's stacked. It's one person? Yeah, it's one. Oh, yeah. Oh. You do it alone. You, you do, do it, it by yourself. Okay, okay. How is yeah. it a team sport? Well, I guess they have it. Well, I'm saying if we they compete a for team. a country, the country then has we're a, team. a team. I was thinking yeah. of the luge has partner luge, and oh. Bob said it's multiple people. Once, yes, but yeah, possibly. the skeleton is just one person going down. Yeah, is yeah. it head first or feet first? It's head first. The skeleton. One of them is head first. One of them is feet first. That's insane. I don't remember head which one first. is which. No, the the yeah, skeleton is head, head first. first. Luge is feet first. People like fly off the side and die, right? Oh, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> but that's why we're doing it. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. You don't care. Uh, never mind. Yeah, you give can a just shit. be practicing and just whoop and you're gone. Swoop, gone. <laughs> yeah, just in practice. That's where not good. Where do you <laughs> practice? <laughs> There's so many things where I don't understand how you practice it no. to get good enough to not die. Yeah. Or like no. even some gymnastics tricks. I'm like, how do you How do you not right. land on your head and yes. your neck I used breaks. to do gymnastics Did too. You really? Me too. Yeah, I when I was well. little. Could you do the rings and go like this and hold yourself up? That's for I was, advanced. I people. was like, see, yeah. <laughs> this is like tumbling. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah right. That, yeah, okay, yeah. We're on the same <laughs> like page. Like the trampoline up in town. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we did. Yeah, like trampoline. Head somersault. Stand. Yeah, 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 yeah. That sounds fun. It was fun. It was. It was fun until I just I didn't want to do it anymore. I have a terrible fear of heights, and you have to yes. once you got to that thing of swinging on those bars. The bars, uneven bars. That is scary. I did not like yeah. it. Yeah, flipping I off hated crazy. It. Fli flipping off. Well. Just grabbing them, I was okay, but you, you're supposed to go like, oh, yeah, the, I, yeah, yeah, doing the, like the like flips the, around. I don't know yeah. how they do that. I didn't love it. Oh, God. That's I did scary. not love it. No, I yeah. can see that. That's scary. But I could absolutely do the skeleton. Uh, and yeah, me too. I might compete for. I guess we'll just do it for Russia. <laughs> yeah. You can also get good at the ones that are like, I think, no shade, archery. Yes. Oh. That's a, a loser test. could do that. <laughs> like if you have 2020 vision and a steady Easy hand, a loser. Which I do not. Honestly, <laughs> honestly ridiculous. Like, I got this. Ridiculous that people have to train for that. <laughs> that okay. Sense. Well, there's there's ones. Curling. I'm just saying. There's stuff. There's Curling medicine. easy. <laughs> easy. 
When you won, I'm curious about this. Yeah. Your Courage Award. Yeah. Were you the only one to get this award? Yes, I was. <laughs> <laughs> it was straight up invented for me. <laughs> Everyone, Aww. we were having like MVP and like most improved and whatever. And I had a plaque that said Courage Award. It was just like a second of feeling pride. And then it kind of it went. Okay. Uh -oh. <laughs> Wait a minute. Yeah. No, this is full on shade. <laughs> yes, I am humiliated. And this was high school. It was high so school. So you were definitely old enough to be like, ooh, that wasn't so oh, nice of you. Oh, that's ridiculous. Right. If it was like elementary school, then that's fine. But it was given by the captains of the team, too. It wasn't, and they were nice. It wasn't like, ha, it's like prank. We're going to like, yeah. you know, sarcastically give her a shameful right. award. It was like, no, I earned I earn that award. It would have yeah. been better to get like a Miss Congeniality. Is that a an yeah, award for sports or like best team spirit. <laughs> Not really. Yeah, yeah, no. yeah, just, okay. yeah right. Something Instead like of that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Inventing like a whole other thing. But I never was athletic, so like that is why cross country and track were good because mm. I just felt like I was running and yeah. I was kind of like You're doing my exercise. own thing, you know. Yeah. And then I did um I did had like in the past I'd done volleyball and soccer and, wow. and dance. There's like a lot of pressure for me on team sports or anything with hand eye coordination with a ball. Right. I was like it I have me none. out. I'm very bad. Like, um, and figure out where, like, okay, baseball, that bat is like this thin, right? Right. And How do you ball, get it to the ball? No! <laughs> this goes here, so I go like that? No! I, I famously could never hit it. And I, I would, my mom would get mad at me. Did you ever do t-ball? I tried everything, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I Katie, tried it all. Katie, you asked me to pass you a ball the other day, just in the office. I know. And that was that was real bad. When someone's like, oh, hey, heads <laughs> up, can you throw something at you? Do you I hate like it. I yeah, do. I yeah. flinch. But you asked me. I did. This I has said, happened throw multiple that times. basketball at me. Yeah, yeah. And then I freaked out when you did it. <laughs> and I screamed, and it did not work. I did not catch it with my hands. It's crazy how fast balls go. I hate them. <laughs> No balls. No balls. No balls. Well, the half pipe has no balls, nor does the <laughs> nor does the skeleton. skeleton. So we're it. We're <laughs> it. So true. Okay. Wait. Did we show you guys uh, things? Your Twitter things. What do you guys have to 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 promote? Oh, Jane, like our Twitters. You yeah, or shows. You have a show to promote? Sure. Like in LA, <laughs> if people, or like a yeah. thing that people, like on the internet? No. <laughs> oh, in, in Los Angeles. In Los Angeles. Okay. I host two comedy shows. I host Reductress's stand up show with College Humor's Reka uh -huh. at the Virgil, the yes. first Friday of the month. And I host a pop culture show called Obsessed, the first Saturday of the month at the Pack Theater. And my Twitter is at Janie Fierce. Yay. Thank you. My Twitter is. At Katie Maravich. That's and also my Instagram is at Katie Maravich. I think they saw and that. And I don't already. have anything to promote. Okay, so. that's, all right, that's good. Okay, that wasn't <laughs> so, good. That, no, no, that was uh, great. All right. Yeah. So if you're watching this on the CH2 channel, uh, thank you so much. But guess what? This is old. So jokes on you. Go over to Dropout. Subscribe to Dropout. We got uh, lots of shows yeah. on there, plenty of shows. We got Rank Room the on rank there. Rank Room! Yay! And we got the Discord where you can chat with us and all join kinds of stuff. Join our team. And yeah, our, the our Discord where you can team. join our skeleton team. We'll be holding auditions Russia. and having rehearsals. Right, um, that's yes. what it's called. <laughs> <laughs> We're very, very athletic. <laughs> all right, thank you so much for watching. Hey, it's Raphael. If you like college humor and want to support us, sign up for Dropout. For the low price of a whole lot of straws per month, you'll get videos like this a whole week sooner. To chat with us live on the Dropout Discord and exclusive content such as troopers. Set a course for the Dread Cruiser. Set a course for the Dread Cruiser. Set a course for the Dread Cruiser. Sign up for your free trial today. You don't need all those straws. Give them to me.